Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy, um, Faison, and today I'm gonna teach you how to uh, make a dupe step. And to do that, we're gonna use Fourth Studio. Um, it's a uh, draw, and I'm gonna pick uh, this uh, thing that I, I got on the internet. Um, yeah, so that that's called a. Uh, uh, um, uh, I don't, I don't remember. Uh, anyway, so this, hang on, I gotta get some water. <sighs> Sorry guys, I just got back from, uh, I got back from walking on the treadmill. Now I'm thirsty, so I'm just getting some water. Um, oh, by the way, y'all should subscribe and like the video, uh, Bruh. Uh, uh, by the way, sorry for being gone for three years. Um, anyway, so this is a base that I'm making. I just made it. I don't really know what, what it does. It just sounds good and loud. And uh, This is a plugin called OTT. It's a... I don't know what it does. Uh, maybe you can figure it out. If you know how to produce dubstep, uh, let me know in the comments. Um, but drop a like if you enjoy the video. Um, I'm gonna be coming at you live with some Warzone gameplay soon. I just got the new Modern Warfare, and it's really cool. I like playing games. So this is a, a core, um, production. So yeah, and, um, I, I made it with notes. And, yep, that's how you do it. And as you can see, the notes go, like, up and down, but not at the same time. Uh, you gotta, like, make it go forward, like, to the right. And then, uh, I think it sounds really good, so I'm gonna add in some, like, drums, I guess. Uh, so just go to the drum folder on your hard drive and pick a, a drum. Uh, so after you pick your, like, your big drums, you gotta pick the, like, the, the, the other ones. And there they are. Um, I just use loops because I find them easier to use when they loop. So I'm using it. Uh, this video is kind of long, so I'm just gonna speed it up for you. Uh, just like pause and watch how I, I make the web. I have some like tips on sound design. I wrote them down, hold on. Um, you want to uh, use serum, LFOs, and OTC and filter movement. And, uh, don't forget to resample. Don't forget to, uh, resample as well. Yeah, so I think the, uh, dubstep part's pretty good. I'm done recording that part. It's pretty good. Uh, but keep in mind, like, this is, uh, you know, not as good as I, I normally do. Because I'm recording, I'm actually really much, really good actually when I'm not. Okay, let's move on to the intro. Um, I'm just going to copy and paste the uh, my guy from the drop. And uh, this is called a, a roots. I could show you how to make it, but uh, I don't want people knowing my secret techniques. Uh, you got to keep that stuff locked away in the vault. You know, I don't want people to steal my sound. Like, to be honest, um, I don't even think I, I make music at this point. It's really, like, I just make images in people's heads through sound. Um, I, like, weave, uh, audio memories. Because I don't make music. I make, uh, audio experiences for the ears. Uh, I added kick drums to the intro. And then I, I turn the sound into an art. I mean, you know, like, that's how you do it, or whatever. Here's the full, uh, song.
that's it for the video. Uh, rate five stars. Uh, follow me on Google Plus. And you know we and remember we did this as a team. Uh, Phasing is more of a community thing. You know it's not all about me. So join the Discord. So I can pressure you into watching my videos and paying me money. Join the Discord so we can foster a creative community and grow together as a family. And uh, like the video and subscribe and comment because uh, I care about you specifically. Happy April Fools and I'll catch you guys next time.